you see my hand? No. That was up like this. I didn't see it. <laughs> what are you filming? A hall. What hall? Our call. Oh, okay. Can, do you need something? I just wanted to say hi. <laughs> Hello. Burritos are ready. I know, Daddy texted me. Okay. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. It's your girl Jay, and today I'm here with a little book haul from Simon & Schuster Canada and Penguin Teen. They sent me a couple of 2020 arcs, so I thought I would share them with you all. So without further ado, let us get started. <gasps> I'll start with the Simon & Schuster books first. The first one they sent me is to be released in March 2020. It is In Five Years by Rebecca Sorrell, and this follows a woman named Danny who has her entire life planned out for the next five years. She lands a job that she's been dying for. And then she receives a marriage proposal from her boyfriend. She accepts it, goes to sleep with him, but then she wakes up with a different ring on her finger beside a man that she's never seen before. She ends up spending one hour, five years into the future before she wakes up back in her bed. She is very shook by this experience, but she decides that she's going to throw herself into her job and her relationship until she comes face to face with the man from her dreams. And that's when her entire five-year plan is a little shaken up and it's like the story of that. So so I'm guessing it's going to be like a cute chiclet contemporary novel. It's very short, only 250 pages, so it's one that I'll be able to fly through real quick. The next one they sent me is also releasing March 2020. It is Darling Rose Gold by Stephanie Warble, and it follows a girl named Rose Gold whose mother lies about her being very sick, and her mother gets sent to jail and then when she is released, Rose Gold takes her back into her home because she doesn't have anywhere to go. Rose Gold is now a mother herself, so she understands why her mother did what she did, but her mother will stop at nothing to get Rose Gold back under her thumb, and so it's like the story of them like battling it out and her trying to protect her newborn son from her mother. I'm assuming it's like supposed to be similar to the Gypsy case where she like murdered her mother for pretending that she was sick or something like that. I don't know the whole like thing behind that but that's my guess because it sounds very similar to that. Maybe she's gonna kill her mom. We don't know but I'm intrigued. The next one is also being released March 2020. It's A Conspiracy of Bones by Kathy Reichs. This is actually the 19th book in a series so I'm a little bit behind with this one. I did look it up and it says that you can read it not in order if you want. It follows a different mystery with every novel, so it's not like it's a continuation, it's just the same characters, so I'm hoping that that's the case and Google didn't lie to me, but it's, like I said, like a mystery novel, so. And then the final one that Simon & Schuster sent me is releasing April 2020, and it is To Have and To Hoax by Martha Waters, and this one I think sounds really funny. It's about a lady and a lord who are married five years ago, and then they get into this huge fight and haven't spoken in four years. Lady Violet ends up receiving a letter saying that her husband has been gravely injured in a horsing accident, so she rushes to his side and discovers that he is completely fine, so she is not very happy about this and decides that she is going to fake an illness, so the Lord ends up finding out that she's faking, so he decides to play along with it and it just becomes this whole fiasco and it's like the story of them like pretending they don't like each other but they do like each other and it's like a comedy romance rom-com kind of thing but I think that it sounds pretty funny so I'm excited for it. Penguin Canada also sent me two books as well. The first one is releasing February 2020 and it is The Last Confession of Autumn Casterly by Meredith Tate and this follows two sisters and they don't get along very well but then one of them, Autumn, is kidnapped and being held hostage. She ends up leaving her body to try to go find help so I don't know if that's something that she was able to do before or if it's like something that she just discovered she could do but she goes to find her sister for help and then leads her sister Ivy to where she is being held captive and basically she uncovers a bunch of clues about Autumn that she didn't know about but it's like this huge like mystery that Ivy has to solve in order to save her sister Autumn. I don't know I think it sounds kind of cool also very confusing. And then the last book that Penguin sent me is called The Best Laid Plans. It's by Cameron Lund, and this is to be released in April 2020. It's a friends to lovers 
book. That's all I really know about it. The back says, don't worry, Cameron Lund's hilarious swoony debut has everything you're looking for. Hot guys, flirty text messages, awkward mix-ups, inside jokes, steamy kisses, lots of pizza, secret crushes, epic prom drama, and friends to lovers, which I'm a big fan of. So I'm intrigued. I'm excited. Gonna read this one probably first, to be honest. All right, everybody. So that was the arcs that Simon Schuster Canada and Penguin Canada sent me this time around for 2020. Thank you so much to them for sending them my way. Let me know down below if you guys plan on reading any of these when they're released or if you see this video by the time they are released because knowing me I'm not gonna edit this in time because that's how we are on this channel. Let me know what you thought of them if you've read them already and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye!